growing air traffic, there is no other way but improve the procedures and improve the tools. The ACWP uh, project is a good opportunity and a good collaboration. This benefits the controller, the pilots and also it can link to airport systems. Help controllers uh, in their situational awareness, help them be ahead of the traffic. I think uh, change greatly the way they work. Controller's workload is less uh, stressed and it's a safe environment for everyone. It's promising. The Advanced Controller Working Position is a transversal project in which we integrate all the uh, functionality developed by the uh, airport uh, projects in uh, CESAR. In this uh, project we integrate uh, functionality such as routing, safety nets and the guidance uh, such as uh, the taxi. So the main purpose is to validate the uh, human machine interface including all those functions. During this validation we compare the introduction of these uh, functions to the baseline which doesn't contain any uh, functions. The main idea is to see the impact of introducing uh, all those HMI new functionalities on uh, situation awareness on the controller workload. The advanced controller working position is really a amalgamation of several screens that the controller uses today. So normally in a tower they will have electronic flight strips, ASMGCS, the approach view, met information. And here we are bringing this information into one or two screens to help uh, facilitate the controller's role. Well. The tool was developed uh, together with DFS and Eurocontrol. Uh, we pushed very much um, what we call an open architecture where we define together uh, open interfaces where the different <laughs> products from the different vendors can be integrated into one uh, CWP. Well, Eurocontrol has the um, operational knowledge. We as frequenters in DFS, or this part of DFS we represent, uh, we are software developers and we need the operational input and we need someone to validate what we are doing. The next uh, step of uh, this project is uh, to validate other uh, functionalities and to be able to go to the implementation with a good uh, result coming from uh, this kind of uh, validation. So we hope that by this that uh, industrial will produce new systems integrating all functionalities in one HMI which is the main goal of this.